What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. Let's continue our journey. The matriarch has shown up. We have Adam Warlock. All the pieces are coming swat, together. Golden boy, you're making me nervous. Or perhaps your nerves need nine. What did I do? This precarious plan proves more meek by the moment. The Madonna was meant to be among us. She knows what she's doing. Eventually. What sorry sins I have wrought to rest me among such a motley crew. Did he? Did he take my room? <laughs> Not so much as a yip from the mud. Groot says he'll keep trying. Where's Mr. Fancy Words? He has assumed Peter Quill's quarters. It was a daring display of dominance. Don't you start. Usually I'd say who needs him, but we do. So you better fix this one, Quill. Just try not to piss him off any more than he already is. If it is to be a fight to the death, I will honor the outcome. If he kills you, I get your guns. Wouldn't bet on Peter winning that fight. It took all five of us to beat him last time. I still can't believe he caught one of my smart bombs. Just like that. We have already fought the man. Hold on. You don't remember? I remember Spark. Hey, Warlock. Open up. This is my room, you know. And that would be my cassette cover. You pen this pithy poetry? It's not poetry, it's music. Hard rock. It's supposed to have guitars and bass and drums. Simplistic scriptures, as is its scribe. Okay, what's your deal, man? What did I do to piss you off? Your lamentable leadership allowed the Madonna to leave when we needed her talents to travel to the telepathic realm. Mantis had good reason to stay behind. We just need to get Nikki and get the hell out so we can find her again. Your tenuous tactics trust too much to fortune. Can you confidently convince me your meager measures may amply manage this mission? Yes. Absolutely. Wise words. Sure and measured, but beheld by my bemused misgivings, your demeanor differs distinctly in direction from my more willful ways. Maybe we can meet in the middle then. Yes. An oath! Will you own an oath to operate with greater aggression? To give gravitas to gravid seasons of your soul and struggle not to stand on destiny's icy flows? Sure. This guy's like a walking thesaurus. Whatever it takes. Then assert it. I swear I'll be a good leader. That I'll be decisive and, and, uh, that I won't let Manus do whatever she wants. I stand partially reassured. What about you, Mr. Fancy Words? How do I know you won't see Raker and have a change of heart? Why would I weasel away? Didn't you used to be best buds with him? We were common company for a fleeting fallow, through which I witnessed the incommensurable extent of his sadness. He mourns his lost son. That's why he's doing all of this. The church, the matriarch. Because he wants to get his kid back. But that can't happen, right? Magus can't... No. Cannot. So? We can count on you? When you reunite with Raker, that man's gotta go down. Indubitably. So, how is he? Moore, are you okay letting Mantis fight the church alone out there? She won't fight. She'll focus on evacuating people. Maybe they can all hide in the caves. So she's just gonna let the church take over her home world? Mantis would tell you that people matter more than the planet. And she knows that the church won't stop coming until we rescue Nikki. You have great confidence in this celestial Madonna. She's one of the few people I know I can trust. Really? She freaks me out. Because she's smarter than you? And kinder. I am Groot. Hey, that nickname makes my skin crawl. I'm furry, not fuzzy. Not even that little. Hey, Quill. You seem like you're in a good mood. Uh, do I? I've got a great idea for a new blaster extension. Can't wait to put it together. Well, now that the gang's back together and we've got a minute to breathe, 
I think you deserve an official thank you for what you did on Lamentis. <laughs> Quill, I, uh... I know you don't like that kind of sappy stuff, but I really mean it. Knowing about the crap those scientists did to you, not only does it make my blood boil, it puts everything into perspective. Oh, come on, it was just a puddle. I don't know if I could have gotten over something like that. You saved our lives, man. You deserve a bit of praise. The rodents saved your lives, and scientists were involved. I have many questions. Yeah, well, save them for the next time we all get a drink together, buddy. Give me a tick. I'll be right there. Okay. My health totally doesn't get low. I don't see what tactical scan is going to do to help me. I mean, I feel like I could get it just to see. Just do it. On it? I've made it foolproof. Just for you. Provides clues how to defeat them. Time slows down while you're scanning an enemy. I mean, usually it's like if they're weak to an element, it shows, but eh, who knows? Maybe it'll be really useful or something. Did you reach Cosmo? Explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Deceased wife and daughter are with me to thank the matriarch for her gift. May the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land at the spaceport. Regiments, while we wait, whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, Gold. What the flark? Great, the cone boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. I mean, I don't know much about Adam Warlock, but from the little bit I googled, I understand he has like. He's like basically the best Let's person at using the Infinity the Stones. He has like intimate knowledge Nikki. of him or some shit. Where he can do stuff that other people can't. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we like, try to find him? Time is running out. We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on his side. Let's do this. Time to save Nikki. Peter. Okay. Just be cool. Let me handle these guys. Travelers, have you come to witness the fulfillment? The what now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and cleared to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! <laughs> Wrath of Katab. 
Oh, now we'll do moderate damage and heavy stagger to a single enemy and moderate stagger to all nearby enemies in the rage. She also deals more stagger damage on rage. Should maintain distance, leverage companions to the circulation. Take down the flyer! He's healing the oh, What are you waiting for? Shoot him in the face! What the? Coach is choosing his team ever! Then put him in a body bag! Problem? Solution! Let loose, Rocket! You owe me one, Quill! Not going into the light this time, little buddy! Oh, come on! That's bullshit, dude! No, I had- I got the super punch. I had all the health there. Oh my god. Some bullshit. Guys, huddle up! I haven't done this in a while. I didn't mean to do it, but... What are we waiting for? These blades are thirsty! Mine too! I want to run in there right now and do some serious damage, Peter! Blades are thirsty. Okay, look! We just need to show some backbone here. The backbone is showing. No, no! I, I mean, we've got more power and speed than these goons, so there's no need to be afraid of them. Who's with me? I suspect you need. Well, well. better pray their new world comes without death or pain or fear because i'm gonna kill them for flarking up this spaceport they have been very busy redecorating all the more reason for us to get to the cortex and find nikki scott cosmos towers shut down that's because it's never been dark before you do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security this does not bode well for the dog Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. Just because the tower shut down doesn't mean Cosmo is too. Last time we were here, he knocked out me, Gamora, and Drax, and Lady Hellbender's bounty hunters. Like it thing. Kinda dreading what we're gonna see in the marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Nowhere really stunk sometimes, but. Clark! Over there! There's so many of them. I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but these crooks were suspicious of anyone. Yeah, I don't know, Rocket. Like Gamora said, everybody wants something. The church tailors their offer to the individual. Seems to me most of them would give in. Or they'd be killed. Not an easy choice. They got Clark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hell's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the continuum cortex. To siphon faith from multiple worlds at once? Is that even pop? Hey! Check it out! We got bad guys! 
Everything you have, everything you have, you do need your ultimate. So then, the only thing I'm missing is stagger wave. Hundred units says they're tied to the fulfillment. Priest said that they were bringing. They can't raise the dead, especially after we save Nikki. I had a contact here. Check some of the other outfits. Don't have any drow. Got the Nova Core one for her. Rotations ago. You did? Was it blurf? No, no, no. Should up on puts, maybe? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cat free. She always gave fruit to grapes. Babe, we got turned around. This is where I came in. I don't suppose we could try tricking them again? Make them believe we're all promised stuff. Not unless you can fake that purple glow they all seem to have. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. There is no way through this wall. Could be a bunch of wackos just waiting for us on the other side. Good point. Peter, you should find a way over to check. What? Hey, Peter! Well, that didn't work. I'm going in. What about the fanatics? I'll toast them if I see them. We're the only ones that can do this, right? Clear back here, Quill. Looks like you're gonna have to yank a chunk free from this side, though. If I can find a way over there. You think you can anchor to this, Gamora? Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Let's hope it holds. Look at her. This is personal, Quill. I'm surprised the church was able to seize the cortex. There has been no sign of Goldie Bronze since he left from our ship. Adam Warlock. It might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. I know how much you love this dive. It was the one spot in this whole Flarkin galaxy where a guy could feel safe. I mean, except for the bar brawls, and the security raids, and the bounty hunters. We'll drink to it later. Right now, we've got to keep moving. When we are done here, we will need to tell a Rapsix about these adventures. A what? They are the keepers of Katafia lore. This will be an epic tale. And yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for, anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Nagus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. My memory is flawless. I'm just an optimist. Ha! You know why we need Warlock Sweet. to stop yeah, Magus' space magic ritual? We don't know space magic! Yeah, because that ain't a real thing. Man, I'm not so sure anymore. Not after Lamentis. <laughs> Looks like the church... There's treachery. Okay, we got this. Whoa. The Emporium used to be right here. Did the church destroy it? Doubt it. The Collector probably blasted out of here at the first sign of trouble. Before the first sign. The Collector's supposed to be able to see the future. Before the first sign. The Collector's supposed to be able to see the future. Oh yeah? Never saw me coming, that's for sure. Had no idea I'd bust through it out of there. I am <laughs> Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. 
Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nah, the Cortex could... Maybe Raker's trying to reanimate the Celestial Head, bring it back to life. Perhaps he wishes to turn it into a ship. Ah, this thing's deader than dead. It ain't coming back, and it ain't jumping through no hyperspace. They say Celestials are powered by hyperspace. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop whatever they are doing. And we'll have to be ready for them to try and stop us. The converted ones will be prepared to die in order to bring their loved ones back to life. Which is pretty ironic, if you think about it. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We have become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy Flarkin family? What are you doing with that garbage? She's not garbage. Never better. Yep, definitely not good. Gamora, wait, hold on a sec. Why? Some more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rager's flarked up church. Oh, of course not, just... Just what, Peter? I don't know. Breathe. Every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Raker brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos! It's about Nikki, and what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. 
What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his Kratakin hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's Promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... kind of enjoyed being on. All things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... she loves us. I did not. You did? You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I could take. We accept you, Gamora Zenbury. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. Let's say we go stop a nut job cult leader. Yes. <laughs> it was uh, surprisingly wholesome at times. Anyway, we're gonna wrap up here. We got more coming up as we make our way to the matriarch. Y'all stay tuned, and I'll catch you soon with more.